Jamie, Prince of Planet Blarb, flees to Earth to escape the villainous flocks who want to eat him alive. So they send an agent to capture him with the help of a mutant cow. Jamie meets Erwin Walsh, a young Earthling who will become his best friend, for better or worse. Jamie's got tentacles, friendship, suspense, and tentacles. Jamie, what are you doing? I'm fixing my saucer. Can't you see that? I can certainly hear that. You're going to wake up my parents, and if they catch us out here at night... Hold on. You, you're going back home, aren't you? Of course not. I just want to go for a spin in my saucer. Ooh, you had me worried. <laughs> Jamie, you better not do that. My dad's going to see you with his telescope. Everyone will find out that you're an alien. They'll hand you over to the scientists. We'll never see each other again, and I'll be all alone, like before. Erwin, you do realize that if I go for a spin, I'll take you with me. I'll even let you drive. <laughs> cool. That rocket! Oh, Sergeant Gratchet! Wake up! Jamie's about to escape! Oh. Hey, you big lazy cow! You weren't programmed for snoozing, but to catch that snotty little blob! Take fire! But you're hurting me! Let me down, you incompetent cow! Oh, but it's you, Lieutenant! I thought it was Jamie. As if we even vaguely resembled one another. All right, now try and concentrate. I have a plan. Listen carefully and look me squarely in the eye. Uh, oh, okay, but which one? <sighs> it works. Listen to that motor hum. Jamie, <laughs> we're going to get caught. Maybe we should take off now instead of listening to the motor. Howdy, neighbor. <gasps> What's all this racket I hear? Jamie, turn it off! Ouch! <laughs> Hello, Mr. Farmer. Out for a little evening stroll? I thought I heard a motor. <gasps> the kind of motor that keeps folks awake at night, if you see what I mean. <laughs> a motor? Uh, there aren't any motors around here. That's for sure. Except for my flying saucer, of course. <laughs> <laughs> There's no saucer, no motor, no nothing around here. In fact, I don't even know what we're even doing here. Come on, Jamie, let's go. Oh, well, excuse me for intruding then. Bye-bye. Uh, Why is it working? I found the owner's manual, but I can't understand a thing. Everything's written in blarb. I don't see why it won't start like before. So is it Ugh. the big day at last? Praline, what are you doing here? I just came to watch your slimy monster friend take off. I wouldn't miss it for the world. <laughs> well, yes, that is if I can get it to start. Why didn't you say so? Let me give you a helping mm -hmm. hand. As if you knew how a flying saucer worked. the best, Praline. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be sick. Erwin, we're still on the ground. <laughs> oh no, not on my brand new seats. Do you realize how you drive? Yeah, sorry. But it's been a long time. It'll come back to me. I can feel it. <laughs> 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 
Sergeant Gratchet. Reporting for duty, Lieutenant. Look outside and tell me what you see. Mm. Uh, well, looks a lot like Jamie Salsa. It mm. is Jamie Salsa, you fool! The one you were supposed to sabotage! That's strange. I sabotaged it just like you told me, and real good, too. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if you can do anything right. I do give good milk, you know. Huh? Honey, wake up! They're here! They're coming! Go and get my welcome speech! It's in the drawer of the bathroom! Quick, fix your hair! I gotta put on some pants. I'll mow the lawn and set up some lights in the yard! <laughs> we should head back home now. My parents are gonna be worried. Already? Okay, let me fly us back down. See how slowly we're going? Well, at least no one's sick, are they? This is no fun. Even my mom can do better than that. Come on, speed up a little. Ah! Jamie, knock it off! <laughs> I'm the one who's taking us home now! Oh, oh no! Jamie, the steering wheel stuck! Just slow down! I can't! Nothing's working anymore! <laughs> Don't panic. I'll find a way to fix this. Erwin, I think we have a problem. Oh, you think? Gee, what do you know? Oh, huh? Praline, what in the world are you doing here? He was never planning on going home. He just wanted to go for a spin, that's all. And now, we're stuck here in outer space. You know, in outer space, no one can hear you scream. Well, as long as we're stuck here, we might as well make ourselves at home. Stay on this crummy rock? Are you nuts? Praline is gonna fix the saucer and then we're heading home. I can't, because we left the toolbox back on Earth. <laughs> this should lure them here. A beautiful landing strip for our new friends from outer space. I changed the sheets in the guest room. If they decide to stay, you never know. <laughs> Just stay here and do nothing. Obviously, I think I have a deck of cars in the trunk. <clears throat> no, what I mean is we need to try something so we can leave. With your tentacles, you could catapult us across outer space. Ah, ouch. You think you can do that? I could try. I guess if I can't, we can always play cards. <clears throat> Better aim straight, otherwise we'll crash into the sun. <gasps> what did he say about the sun? What you up to, Lieutenant? What do you think? I'm calling the blocks to let them know we have failed miserably and Jamie has left planet Earth. Uh, hello, General. Lieutenant Eye Contact here. Oh, okay. I thought you were ordering pizza because I was going to say, I'll have some extra cheese. Some... <laughs> You'll never believe this, but Jamie has left planet Earth. I realize it's a shame, but... Uh, uh, hang on a second, General. Forget what I just said. He's back. I always said those two were blockheads. There they are! <laughs> Fix your hair, honey! Welcome, friends from outer space! Make yourselves at home! We are honored! And if you're hungry, I made you a... <gasps> Children? Is that you? Uh, yeah, and what are you guys doing out here in the middle of the night? 
We're waiting for the aliens. <laughs> Didn't you see their flying saucer? It belongs to Jamie. He took us out into space and we got stuck on this stupid planet. And after that, we... Now, now, dear. It's very late. You should be in bed. They mustn't find the saucer. We need to come up with a good story. So you know what to do. I'll distract their attention while you kidnap Jamie. It's now or never saw it. You know, we really shouldn't stay out here. Because we got to look at those aliens, and they don't seem friendly at all. Yeah, they're coming to destroy the planet, big ugly brutes. Vlox, no doubt. Yeah? Well, let them go ahead and try. I may be a nice guy, but you better not mess with my planet! There they are! Run for cover, kids! Take that! Now go home, blasted aliens! Boy, that was disappointing. I'd really like to meet some friendly aliens for once. I bet you will one day, Dad. You see that? Jamie flew off and now he's back again. What do we do? Should we go back? Do as you please. Go back, don't go back, whatever. I'll leave it to you. Personally, <sighs> I'm hitting the hay. <laughs> yeah, hitting the hay sounds good too. <laughs>